Oh, hey, baby, I... I didn't realize you'd still be up. Where have I been? Um, it doesn't matter right now. I know I just took off, but I'm home now, and I have no intention of leaving again. No, I'm, I'm okay. I'm not walking weird. Well, if I am, it's because I have to pee, so we need let me get to the bathroom. Oh, damn it. I look worse than I thought. The entire left side of my face is purple and black. Oh, shit, my hands. They look like they, they've been put through a meat grinder. I can't let him see me like this. Got to get him into bed, and then I've, and then I can clean myself up. Uh, what, babe? I'm fine. I, I'm not lying. I I said I was fine. I'm just getting ready for bed. Why don't you go ahead and jump in? I'll. I, I'm gonna grab a shower. Love you. Good night. Dear God, please just let him go to bed. I I don't need to deal with any more crap tonight. If he sees me, everything is going to go to hell real damn fast. And I can't deal with that tonight. I don't hear him. Hopefully he went to bed. I'll just turn the light off and open the door to go get some clean clothes. Son of a... Baby, you scared me. <laughs> Why are you skulking around the bathroom door? There's nothing wrong with my face. I'm just fine. Go to bed. Baby, why are you moving me back into the bathroom? Sweetie, stop. Seriously. Stop. God, his face. He gets to see my stupidity in all its glory. Beat up face, busted up knuckles, ripped clothes along with a bunch of scrapes and bruises. Hmm. No. No, I didn't wreck my bike. I, uh, I uh, had a, a run-in with a couple of jerks at a gas station. Stop. Stop. I'm fine. All right, my face and hands say otherwise, but okay, okay, I'll, I'll sit down. No, no, I'm okay. Just a little sore is all. Yeah, the medicine gets under the sink. <laughs> I can feel it. All hell is about to break loose. I know it's going to hurt, baby. I know. Starting with the lip first. I got you. Uh, mm. No, I, I, uh, I don't think I need stitches. I'll be fine. And now he's making his way to my eye. So much of it I'm hiding under my hair, and that's about to change. Yep. There's the anger. Jaw set in a hard line and his eyes lit up. Sweetie, I didn't get anything I don't deserve. After making you worry the way I did, I... I know I scared you to death by just up and leaving and I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, that, uh, that cheek and I are tender. What? Show you my hands. Uh, okay. His fingers are trembling. He's really holding back from exploding at me or either just exploding in general. <laughs> well, at least I got in a few good punches. Oh, crap. And his eyes are welling up with tears. What? I, no, I'm not holding my rib. No, I'm fine. 
no, baby, I'm not taking my shirt off. No, I'm not. Because I said so, baby, you're not taking it off either. Uh, fine. Fine, I'll, I'll take it off. I can't even open my eyes because I can't bear to see his face. Because I know what he's looking at. The trail of fist and boot prints make their way across my torso. I can't stand to see the fury that must be filling his eyes. And it's going to be worse when he finds out this is my fault. He hasn't said anything. Did he, did he leave the room? Oh, hell, he did. Baby, come back. Baby, I'm fine. There is no need to be upset. Baby, please don't cry. All of this is my fault. Yes, I started the fight. It, ah, God, it doesn't matter what it was over. I did, and that's the end of it. So thank you for patching me up. Now I just really want to go to bed. No. No, I am not going to the emergency room. I do not have any broken ribs. No, I am not going to the ER, and that's final. Yeah. <laughs> Don't touch my side, please. Crap, he's upset. And I don't know how much longer I can put up a fight. God, he's never going to forgive me. No, don't. Don't call an ambulance. I'll, I'll go to the ER. Just help me get my shirt back on. Please. Hi, Doc. So, what's the verdict? Um, why is there a police officer in here? To take my statement. Um, officer, this is my boyfriend. We've been dating for over three years. Well, yeah, I can tell you what happened. Why would I want him to leave? No, I'm comfortable enough telling you with him here. Wait. I see what you're getting at. No, my boyfriend did not lay a finger on me. He would never put his hands on me in anger. No, I'm, I'm okay, baby. All right, fine, fine. Look, this is what happened. I had a lot on my mind tonight, so I took my bike out for a ride. After about half an hour... I realized I didn't have enough fuel to make it back to the house, so I pulled into a gas station. There was a bar next door, and after I filled up, I thought I would just go sit down in there for a bit. I didn't go in to drink. I didn't have anything to drink. I just went in to sit and let the music sort of, I don't know, drown out my thoughts for a bit. I was sipping a soda, and two drunk guys started hitting on me. I told him there was no way in hell, and that seemed to do it. They seemed to leave me alone. I didn't pay them any more mind until I realized they were following me out. Breathe. Baby, please. Okay. Uh, one of them hollered out, what is, a fine, <laughs> what is a fine piece of ass doing riding such a fine piece of machinery? And I got mouthy, I popped off and replied, that and not you, that's for damn sure. He stormed over calling me horrible names and acted like he was going to throw a punch or something, so I swung my helmet and cracked him across his face. He hit the ground and the other guy rushed up and I punched him as hard as I could. And before I could move again, the first one had my arms pinned behind my back. And the second one was going to town on me. He said that if I wanted to fight like a man, that they'd be more than happy to oblige. They finally let me go, and I laid there for a bit. 
until I got myself up against the bike. I sat for a few more minutes and then got back on the bike and rode home. Baby, I didn't want to say anything because I'm the one who technically started the fight. They could press charges against me since I took the first swing. Doctor, I'm not making this up. It was outside the service station off of Highway 72. Yes, that one. The bar has cameras as well as the station. I'm sure one of them picked the whole thing up. All right, Doc, I've given my statement to the officer, so how bad are my injuries? Two cracked ribs is the worst of it, and the rest is just bruises and scrapes. All right. Rest for the next five days. No lifting or aggravating the ribs. I got it. Officer, I swear to you that my boyfriend did not do a damn thing to me. Check the freaking tapes. They'll show you. Now, am I free to go home now? It's really late and I just want to go to bed. Thank you. Yes, honey, I'm fine, as long as I don't move. Yes, I promise I'm all right. No, baby, I really don't want to talk about it. I know that we need to, but not right now. My brain and my body can't handle it. Plus, that, that pain pill starting to kick in. To be honest, baby, I, I don't know what I was thinking. The guy called me a bitch C-word, and I just I snapped. It was like all of my frustrations, my inadequacies, my anger just shot to the top, and I exploded. I swung my helmet with all of my might and knocked him on his ass. I just, I didn't think they would go after me the way they did. Please, please stop staring at me with such heartbreak. You didn't do this. It's not your fault. I'm the one who screwed up, so let's just, so just leave it alone for now, please. Sweetheart, I'm tired, I'm hurting, and I just want to sleep. Let me rest, and I promise you we'll talk about it tomorrow. That is if you're still here. Thank you. Good night, baby.